when you don't know how hard a rock is and you can't look it up because you don't know what it's called when you need to know to tell your science teacher and you have nothing but some rocks on a scale you can just use this scale the most hardness scale you need to perform a test called a scratch test no matter what your rock is, it will always work. The most hardness scale, the most hardness scale. When you need to know, just look at the scale. It measures rock's hardness, it measures rock's hardness. Don't stress yourself, just perform one test. It's called a scratch test, it's called a scratch test. Take your mineral and scratch it against a mineral on the most hardness scale. If it gets scratched, then it is lower, but if it scratches the other, it is higher. You can remember that your fingernails are 2.5. This is so you can learn the most hardness scale. No matter what your rock is, it will always work. The most hardness scale, the most hardness scale. When you need to know, just look at the scale. It measures rock's hardness, it measures rock's hardness. Don't stress yourself, just perform one test. It's called a scratch test, it's called a scratch test. They say it's difficult, I say it's really easy, it's just a simple scale. You need to learn it now. Some rocks, they are really hard, like diamond or corundum, or they are very soft, like talc or gypsum. No matter what your rock is, it will always work. The most hardness scale, the most hardness scale, when you need to know, just look at the scale. It measures rock's hardness, it measures rock's hardness. Don't stress yourself, just perform one test. It's called a scratch test, it's called a scratch test.